G'day folks, this is my existing parts catcher and that's a part in the middle of it. These are so small I really think I need to come up with a better parts catcher. This one was made to fit under a 5C collet holder and it just won't get close enough to the chuck. Here you can see what I mean, the parts catcher is actually touching the chuck and the tool is still miles away from the part. So I made it shorter and now it's about level with the tool as you can see circled there. I don't like the big rounded corners and it can be closer to the turret too. This is the first iteration of the design but it really was only just a starting point. As you can see I had to hack away a certain amount of material. I just used a junior hacksaw for that. I did get it closer to the turret though. Throughout this design process I kept cutting the part in half virtually so that I wasn't printing as much. Uh, it saved quite an amount of time. Actually it was about 20 minutes per print. With this print the hole for the tool is just too big. It doesn't need to be there on that side nearest my thumb so I'm going to fill that in. In this print the sides filled in and there's just a V on the front face for the tools to pass through. Here you can see it's, it's actually working. It's not hitting anything, it's just passing through it nicely. I decided to make this part out of TPU, a flexible 3D printing filament, for reasons you'll see shortly. But it works well enough. And I think if any collisions take place, um, there should be survivability all round. Even hitting the chuck shouldn't be a shattering experience. And that's it folks. Thank you for watching.